The fuel door and glove box on Corvette are automatic locking devices. The fuel door is unlocked when the vehicle is unlocked. Locking the vehicle locks the fuel door. With passive remote keyless entry, the driver door must be opened first before the fuel door will unlock. To open the fuel door, push the rearward center edge in and release. The door will open. Also, the fuel door cannot be opened if the key fob transmitter is away from the vehicle. In situations where the battery in the transmitter is insufficient, the fuel door will not open unless the vehicle is unlocked. This may require that the transmitter be placed in the pocket below the steering wheel, not only to start the vehicle, but also to unlock the fuel door. The same points are true for the lock and glove box. The vehicle must be unlocked for the glove box to be opened. This is also the case for the storage compartment behind the screen. Both the fuel door and the glove box are locked when the Corvette Stingray is in valet mode. To access them, it will be necessary to take the vehicle out of valet mode using the commands on the Chevrolet MyLink screen. Valet mode is actuated and disabled by inputting a four-digit code on the keypad. Once out of valet mode, access the glove box and fuel door is allowed. This information and more can be found in sections 2, 4, 9, and infotainment of the owner manual.